Okay, just so we're clear, the manual inside the box is a lot better than the quick one that's at the top of the box when you open it. It's, it says that you do need two people, so good job that you finally, you gave a manual in it, the one on top that's stuck in the box, not good. You need two people to lift it out. They tell you that up front to carry it. Then they say, tilt it down, screen down. People at the, um, the stores, and I'm not gonna say which one, um, uh, <laughs> two major bo big box stores said, do not place the screen down. The image in this says, place screen down on the box that you take off. Then once you do that, then put the legs on. So screen down's okay. Then I watch videos, they say don't travel with screen down flat. But everyone thinks put it on its back and travel. Now I'm hearing different things from actual LG videos. So just be aware, you might want to like travel with it straight up in your vehicle. Good luck with that if it's not a van. And you just gotta make sure that these are pointed forward. There's a certain sort of angle for the feet themselves. And you push it on. And then you tilt it up, of course with two people again and then you tie the cables on so let's go forward with this and follow the instructions and um, do this and see how it goes the instruction says uh, which I have a friend here to help me to take this out of the box we already took this up and over which now we take this off and place this down now what happens is like I said earlier the straps when you take off this thing makes it so you can lift this box right up and over that's what's gonna happen when you release these plastic straps that are like three or four of them across that's what keeps this thing on top so I placed the styrofoam inside here to create a brace a solid structure here to put some because what we need to do which it reads here we got to take this screen out believe it or not and place it down on the box so we can put the T the um, these feet on. These are the feet that it comes with, with the screws, so you'll need to get a screwdriver and whatnot. It's so crazy that most reviews that I got are different nationalities and wording, and so I thought I'd do this video for you. And it's very relevant to most of the 75 inch TVs. The box just comes off in a different way, but this is the process. So I recommend that you go and get a sheet and just put this down. There's some recommendations. It's almost like uh, no dog hair and cat hair and stuff like that and just lay it down on the box and whatnot now it's gonna be a little tippy on this side but we're gonna lay it down so the thing is that it reads on the other manual is that you come to the edge so we're not gonna have this over the edge of it we're gonna have it right the bottom edge to the bottom edge and over it's like pizza we don't want the end to bend no screen to bend so we're gonna take this out now and we're gonna see how this goes so let's go fellow uh, partner here go on this side of the TV over here on this side if you want to come to the right of the back and um, if you can see this uh, little grip down here I'm gonna grip on the top we don't want to squeeze you we don't want to squeeze we just want to grab the top of their hand and there's a little spot in the bottom that we can pull this up and come forward all right so hand on top there's a little grip mark there we're gonna lift it up and, up, and now we're gonna go very lightly, very lightly, align to the top of it primarily, and now we have it down. We have success. Now, in the back of this, there was your instructions, other instructions. We can take this out of here now and start working on the bottom of it. And basically, the there's an A and a B for this here for each of the sides and the reason why you need to snug at the bottom here is so that you can line this up and now you take the bottom half here off and I'm just going to just open it up a bit here take a look around and see what's going on with this fabric that looks like save this for your kids for Halloween they could be something like a space astronaut it looks like some serious uh, neat stuff that you ever need to stay warm this is the stuff. I might have to put this down the bit right to the edge. And that's what they want. They want you right to the edge of the bottom of the box. And right there. Okay. So looking at the bottom of this monolith of a TV. 
bring you over here so you can see what's going on. Now, the legs. We have a, on it you have a B, and then you have an A. So the B is that goes in at the far left of the TV, and the A is in the far, well the left of the TV in the front, and the right, okay? <laughs> you can just refer to the guide and it helps you. The thing is, is that it locks in. And so what it explains is um, to come out, you pull out to unlock it, and it goes in and then down. So you can see that they have these little like hooks and there's like a little latch here. So see how there's like a little L here? So these things with this B side apparently goes, let's go here and down in. see <coughs> it has oh that yeah that's it right there so the goes like that and then down in and it's like totally locked to it and now you got to make sure that the you get these screws they came with these screws that you got to put in and I believe it's a Phillips the diamond this uh, that's the that's the one that uh, has the uh, the the cross like thing and you find a good good one like that and you go in so and I will do the other side and then we'll continue on to it and just check to make sure everything's stable and it's totally in there and then do the other side. Okay, the moment of truth, which is going to take two people to carry this giant TV. Yeah. It's okay. Come down. Keep going. Are we good? Yes. Whoa. Okay. How is it on the back there? Okay, and we are going to now unveil NASA space. <laughs> All right, the unveiling. Here, grab that side. Just bring that up. And the unveiling. Oh, drum roll. You can just put this back in the box. I keep this. this is some good stuff. You go on holidays or something. Leaks in the apartment, painting. Say your apartment. Keep this for looking after your TV. If you're ever doing home renovations, it's a great thing to put over versus a sheet and hairs and whatnot. But that's it. So I used a mal malm. Um, uh, table from Ikea. It actually is the perfect <laughs> length. This is not going to work on your fireplace. I had a 55 inch, worked, the width of the, ta the, the feet too large, uh, and it would be just ridiculous up there. So I'm gonna have to build something on my fireplace to put this in. The 75 inch and above TVs are a brand new era of thinking about things and how to mount them. Mounts and swivels don't work properly from the weight. Um, but again, if you have any questions, ask me in the comments below and I'll see what I can do with some research. Thank you very much and uh, enjoy your TV. See you in another video. So they got this awesome remote. Wow, fancy, ergonomic for your hand. Oh, it's nice. We've got like a whole bunch of things, but this is the on off right there. Let's give it a shot. And Oh, boom. Oh, I wish uh, you could see that there. It's, Let's see, Web OS. This is this is the thing, Web OS that has Chromecast enabled and Amazon Alexa. And um, I guess it's just you got to go through the setup. There's going to be some calibration you need to know. Maybe I'll do another video on that. But um, it wants to see you know when it connect to your Wi-Fi and just go through the process of uh, setting up your TV. And and that's the beginning. I'm just looking around the screen to see if there's any infractions, any sort of blur, any dead pixels. Everything's looking good so far. Press the, OK Press the OK wheel on the remote. So, I guess the OK button is the the center of it. Boom! Here we go. Check this out. That's just fun. Okay. So there's an up, up, down on this. here but I guess we can choose you know what we are so I'm gonna go that is English and it is 
Oh, Espanol, and it's Canada. So I'm gonna click OK. Oh, center button here to confirm it. English is OK. Now it is, and then na time zone. Click on that. I'm, we are Toronto. Boom, center button. Boom, and now once it's once you click in, then you can jump down to the last one. So everything seems good, and click OK. No, I don't. I don't think uh, we need the audio. I'm going to turn it off. So there, there you are. Your TV has been located. Now, oh my gosh, and it all is also like the Wii Remote. Wherever you point, you can actually um, select things, and uh, it's the same thing. So. Let's see, home. Home mode is for watching TV in a home environment store. So I'm gonna go okay. I'm gonna go uh, okay. Middle button, get connected. Let's uh, connect to the, I should almost connect to the ethernet, but let's go wireless for now. And, oh, there we go, and okay. And I go connect, and here we go, connect. Let's gonna see if it can see my Wi-Fi and it is get connected okay it's connected type okay boom surfs up woohoo legal notice you must now agree to everything all the legal stuff always read stuff it's good it's good but uh, nobody does really look at that boing, boing, boing. must be games on this who knows legal notice uh, server has occurred while downloading the user agreement if you do not download okay he needs an internet connection so Maybe there's internet connection issues, ready to watch. Um, turn on, please connect and turn on the power of all connected devices. Start, searching. You just found zero connected devices, so that's okay. Um, I'm not gonna do that right now. We can do that in another video. Satellite, nothing, service area. I'm just gonna go, um, uh, let's go. Netflix, that would be great. Oh, it's definitely that. Yes, okay. And you're almost done. Magic remote to set up. Now let's assume. Holy, that's a lot of that's a lot of things here. After the set top has been set up, you can use the functions. Alright, so maybe I'll turn on my PS3. But I'm thinking that this thing has like a whole bunch of things, so Click next on top of the box. Okay, let's go next. Uh, HDMI, I think it's four that we plugged into. And four is coming online, I believe. No signal. Let's see what's going on here. Yeah, that should be it. And then, and then, oh, there it is, I guess. I had a stereo and a PS3 going through at the same time, and uh, that's the truth of the matter. And it sees it, so let's see what it sees. And this will be interesting. And I just um, a little bit of a ooh Chrome Chromecast. What is this? No signal. That's a that's a that's a pretty big uh, <laughs> picture. Wow. Please check the power on, and away we go. Whew. Okay. Let's see if we can get to, uh, I'm just going to press the Netflix button. Let's see if we can just get over to Netflix and see if we can just log in. That should be the easiest path because there's Netflix on here. There's even a Prime Video, Amazon Prime Video button. How cool is that? And movies and a whole bunch of stuff. Um, so we'll have to go through again and uh, at least you see how you can connect and go through hooking. I suggest a LAN cable for 4K movies. It works better than Wi-Fi. Just find your password, see if you can do that. But I'm going to go through it again. Hope this video helps and um, I'll see you in another one. Thank you very much for your time. If you have any questions, put them in the um, comments below and please subscribe.